There you have it. This is bringing to us the report or the statistics so far. We have now 11 confirmed cases and seven cases are from uh, the coast. The total now is 281 cases confirmed here in Kenya. And of course, we have two recoveries and one of them is a doctor. So the number now stands at 67 of the recoveries made so far and the death uh, total remains at 14. Uh, over 13 tests have been done uh, up to this end, or 13,000 tests have been done to this end. And uh, following the defiance of some Kenyans, 455 of them have been quarantined at their own cost. This is mandatory quarantine because of the uh, unbecoming behavior. We have been asked time and again to observe social distancing and we have seen them uh, even trying to party. A few others were arrested just uh, yesterday evening when they were in a wedding uh, a number of them now coming to 455 uh, the CS has also made a special appeal to uh, the following counties which is Machakos, Moranga, Kajado and Kiambu to protect Nairobi since they were put or they were considered to be part of the metropolitan they should also ensure that they are protect protecting their members and as well as the people in Nairobi from spreading this uh, the coronavirus and uh, a few of them ha that have areas that have been mentioned are at the river in Machakos, uh, Kiambu, we have uh, Zendegua, and uh, uh, Gedurai has been mentioned as well. And of course, you, you, you will understand these are some, uh, some of the areas that are highly populated. And the CS has called on these, uh, on the people from these areas and the uh, authorities to ensure they protect each other. Now, uh, Today, the, uh, being at the Kenyatta National Hospital, assorted protective gears have been distributed, totaling to 4,759. And the CSA says seven, 33 centers are active up to now. And of course, Dr. Amod has said local manufacturers are being engaged to ensure or to see the production of protective uh, gears to our frontline uh, doctors when they are dealing with the COVID-19. And just to emphasize, uh, the CS has called on Kenyans to ensure social distancing. Remember, it has been a call since day one because it is believed and it has been tested that the spread of coronavirus is through contact. And therefore, we have been asked time and again to observe social distancing and of course to have a um, high level of hygiene by washing your hands with running so uh, water and soap and of course using uh, sanitizers and if you're having symptoms like uh, a flu like symptoms that uh, maybe you, you'd suspect them to be of uh, COVID-19 then you need to uh, seek medical advice we have a toll number to call that is 719 you can have all the information you want to know about the COVID-19 from that so those are some of the things that have been mentioned at uh, this day and of course as uh Y254 will be keeping you abreast with the latest as far as COVID-19 is of concern. So the number now stands at 281. And globally, uh, the cases that have been confirmed is over 2.4 million. And uh, the deaths are standing at over 165,000. Kenya uh, has 281 confirmed cases, 69 now, uh, 69 recoveries uh, uh, this has uh, has been uh, due to the two recoveries and one of them is a doctor who was infected by COVID-19 but the death uh, number remains at 14 which is a good thing and we are hoping we will have more recoveries other than deaths and of course as we try to flatten the curve of spreading coronavirus we need to observe the directives that the government have been given. Regarding the 455 people who have been uh, mandatory quarantined it's because of their behavior and just yesterday the CEC, Dr. Mwangangi, said those people who will be uh, arrested or found bleaching the curfew will be quarantined mandatory. And of course now we are seeing it has taken effect. It's a call to everyone. Observe the rules that have been put in place. Ensure you do not spread the coronavirus because you won't tell whether you have it until you have the symptoms or until you have been tested. Mass testing has begun in Mombasa and we're expecting it to roll out to other places in the country even as the 
uh, Moi Teaching and Referral Hospital coming up to help uh, the uh, Kenyatta National Hospital and Bagadi in testing. So we are hoping as a nation we will have a mass testing rolled out throughout the country and to get to know how to mitigate these measures. My name is Dereva Hillary. I will be uh, leaving you with that. And um, okay, here we have the numbers now in new cases in Kenya stands at 11. Active cases are 198. We have 281 total cases, 14 fatalities. Those are the deaths that have been recorded and 69 recoveries. One of them of the two who have recovered today is a doctor and 13,872 tests have been done so far. So this is how the situation is in Kenya and of course Nairobi remains to be uh, leading in numbers followed by Mombasa. Therefore Kenyans we need to be cautious and try to control the spread of coronavirus. See you again. My name is Dereva Hillary. Good afternoon.